All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Ballin' With. Uh, don't have the hood on, don't have the hat on, but I got the Steelers jersey on. We're staying with sports merch. Every video I have on, I got some type of, um, you know, sports merchandise, NFL and NBA or whatever league I am doing that video on. Uh, with that being said, let's hop right into the series of videos we've been doing today. Uh, we are looking at the Green Bay Packers uh, over or under total wins. According to FanDuel Sportsbook, they had them at seven and a half wins, eight wins total for the Green Bay Packers, question mark. Uh, let's double check and go right down the line of games this season. They are a new look team, Aaron List Rogers team, or Aaron Rodgers List team. You know, but I do think Jordan Love can be pretty great. They are pretty good on quarterbacks. They have some Hall of Famers there that play the position. And every time, you know, a great leads, another great replaces them. And I do think... After the how long Jordan Love's been sitting and watching Aaron Rodgers, you know, prep and do everything as for the team and how he leads them, he uh, his skill level was pretty good coming out as well. First round draft pick, they just you know how I picked them just to have him as a backup, and now they're here in this moment. Um, I do think Packers could win a, a substantial amount of games. They look pretty good this preseason. Uh, they went three and zero this preseason. Oh no, no, they lost one to the Patriots. That was a close game. But I do think they're going to have some close games during the season as well. Um, with that being said, let's hop right on into Week One. Chicago Bears is going to be a great matchup. I do think Chicago Bears will win this game Week One. Uh, just all the um, turmoil coming in with the team. I don't know if the Packers will be ready, but I do think the Bears will be a little bit more readier than them. They have a better defense uh, and. You did more. Just the fields are just you know too top heavy, bro. They they're gonna be running or throwing it, doing everything. Packers are gonna have to keep up with the Bears, I think. Uh, I do think Packers will beat the Atlanta Falcons. It's gonna be another great game. Um, very close. I think Packers can win by a field goal. We have them one and one so far. Um, week three they are playing the New Orleans Saints. Um, Derek Carr led team. I think the Saints are gonna surprise a lot of people. They're gonna win their division. They're gonna go to the playoffs. Uh, and they're going to win this game as well. The New Orleans Saints. So now uh, I got them 0-2. Uh, I mean, 1-2 and two so far. Lost the first game and lost the third game. Then they've come to the Detroit Lions. I think they lose this game as well. They become 1-3. Um, you know, not a bad start as long, as long as you win some games out of the four. And that really determines how far you will go during the playoffs. You know, that kind of gives an indication. So it's your next four going to win. You better win the next four, you know, kind of. Pay back off that one and four start you had. Vegas Raiders. I was about to say Oakland, but Las Vegas Raiders. I think will lose this game versus the the Packers. The Raiders have the squad though. Don't discredit the Raiders out. They're going to be a great team as well. Um, actually, mm, that's a tough one, man. I got, I got, I got the Raiders losing. Uh, I got the Packers winning this game. Uh, some way, somehow. I don't know. No, I got Raiders winning. The Raiders winning this game. So. One and one and five, one and five right now. They only win the Falcons. One and five. I do think they're beating the Broncos here, so two and five. I think they're gonna split one with the Vikings, maybe. Uh, just because that's the really big rivalry right there. Um, and let's say they win this game, so three and five right here. Four and five. Yes. Are they gonna beat the Steelers? I don't think so. Not at home. So four and six, four and seven versus the Chargers. I don't think they're gonna split versus the Lions. They're gonna lose both. Uh, four and eight, four and nine. They're gonna lose to the New York Giants. The Giants are just too a better team than them to me. Four and ten, five and ten here for the Buccaneers. They're gonna beat the Buccaneers. Six and ten versus the Panthers. They might split one of these games on the back end. It depends how that is. They might split the one of these two games here. So the either five, the seven game win team, maybe eight, maybe eight. Um, and after they play really well, I think they hit on the nose with the seven. I think they win seven games. That Raider matchup is gonna be a tough one. They gotta win a couple of those beginning games. If they don't win those couple games, that back in that schedule is gonna be much tougher. And I do think Panthers, they can win the Broncos, Buccaneers, and Panthers at the end, but they gotta at least set themselves up for you know success in the beginning parts of the season. They beat the Bears, beat the Falcons, have a close game with the Saints, close game with the Lions, beat the Raiders. That's, you know, and then Broncos, they have a, a different start. And they could win about eight. Nine is the ceiling. Eight games is doable. I see them winning seven to six to eight games. 
that over eight, I don't know, man. I don't, I mean, eight games total. They could, they could, they could, because some of those games they could win. So I, I go, I go them over, over, because they could split one of those games versus the Lions, versus the Bears, versus the Vikings. Um, so don't sleep on the, the Green Bay Packers. They are a good squad. The office coordinator, the coach is great. Um, I got the Green Bay Packers going over, even though we just looked at it. It's kind of like the seven, eight range. And just kind of like how will the season play out? It's right there on the borderline of that between in between number, then definitely uh gotta, you know, either bet it or go over under it. So we're gonna bet it and go over for the Green Bay Packers. Uh, I think they will achieve that goal or achieve that prop. Um guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Green Bay Packers fans out in Wisconsin, let me know. I picked it right, if that is even the area you guys are in, Wisconsin. Um but uh we got more videos coming out what is the next video the next team uh, is the houston texans it'll be a good video as well uh we got endless videos dropping this up and coming week uh stay tuned for more videos of these uh we got more highlights news sport podcasts sports bets sports challenges coming out as well uh and we're going to be doing local recordings of high school games in the area the dmv we're going to be spotlighting some of the top athletes and we're just trying to get a roll with this Ball and Wish channel and get sports coming in and going out. Straight content, guys. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and catch you guys on the next.